CVS stops selling tobacco, offers quit smoking programs. CVS Caremark plans to stop selling tobacco products in all of its stores starting Wednesday, a move health experts hope will be followed by other major drugstore chains. CVS announced in February that it planned to drop tobacco by October 1 as the sales conflicted with its health care mission. To bolster its image as a health care company, CVS will announce a corporate name change to CVS Health. Retail stores will still be called CVS Pharmacy. CVS, which has 7,700 retail locations, is the second largest drugstore chain in the USA, behind Walgreens. It manages the pharmacy benefits for 65 million members and has 900 walk-in medical clinics. The American Pharmacists Association called on drugstores to stop selling tobacco in March 2010 and several small, independent chains have done so, APA spokeswoman Michelle Spindler says. CVS is the first large chain to stop tobacco sales. CVS announcement to stop selling tobacco products fully a month early sends a resounding message to the entire retail industry and to its customers that pharmacies should not be in the business of selling tobacco, said Matthew Myers, president of the Washington-based campaign for tobacco-free kids. This is truly an example of a corporation leading and setting a new standard. CVS is also launching a smoking cessation campaign that will include an assessment of the smoker's readiness to quit, education, medication support to help curb the desire to use tobacco and coaching to help people stay motivated and avoid relapses.